I always make sure toys don't have eyeballs that can come off or too many strings that can be chewed up and swallowed and cause a blockage. I always make sure if they're going to chew a bone, the bone needs to be larger than the puppy <laughs> and impossible for the puppy to chew off hurtful pieces. Okay, this bone right here is going to last them the whole time that they're still with me. And then Mama can have it all for herself. Yes. This toy right here is the all-time favorite because several puppies can grab it and pull and it's soft. They can teeth on this. It washes and dries real well. Um, I discourage using this type of toy unless you're going to be right with the dog. Put it away afterward because toys like this tend to come apart at the seams. And they can eat the filling and sometimes this stuff here can come off. This is a child's toy, it's not a dog toy. This is in the dog department at Tractor Supply and I'm sure you can find it at, on Amazon. But even though it's a dog toy, I have to constantly give it a haircut once they pull a string out. Because that right there can cause a bad intestinal blockage, folks. You do not want that to happen. So, keep scissors handy and give it haircuts. I encourage just giving a, a chew bone at night or an antler to keep them calm in their crate. If they have a baby dog they can't tear up, that's fine. You just make sure it's indestructible and cannot be swallowed. For more great information, go to dogbluff.com, dogbluff.com.